Hello boys and girls, welcome to this week's theme which is occupation. We will learn what an occupation is and also who has an occupation. We will also talk a little bit about people called community helpers. Boys and girls, we're going to learn so much. What does the word occupation mean? An occupation is a job. It is something that will keep us busy. And this is also a way for us to make money. Now you see the money we earn from working is used to buy the things that we need. And also to buy the things that we want. So by having an occupation, it is very, very important to all of us. Now we're going to talk about who has an occupation. Well, anybody that has a job has an occupation. And most of all, all jobs are very important. But there are ones that are super important. And when you grow up, you will get to choose what job you want to do. Did you ever wonder what mom and dad does all day? When they say they are going to work, now that is their occupation. And remember boys and girls, their jobs are very important to them and especially to you. Different jobs. There are many different jobs in this world. There are people that work in banks. These people are called bank tellers. People that go into space and they are called astronauts. And even some people that cook in restaurants. These people are called chefs. And there are people that design that big tall buildings also. And they are called architects. They are builders and other many more. What are community helpers? Community helpers are people that help the community or the city they live in. There are many different kinds of community helpers and some of them actually work for free. Now these workers are called volunteers. The people that help out in the community are very important. Especially to us. Because without them the community would not function well. We should all appreciate and support the work of the community helpers because their jobs are the super important ones. How do people help the community? Community helpers makes our lives a lot better and a whole lot easier. They do different things to help us all. Like teacher said before, there are many different kinds of jobs. There are many different kinds of community helpers. One example is of a community helper is the sanitation workers. And these are the people that keep the city clean by removing the garbage and other items. They drive a garbage truck and empty our garbage bins or trash cans. I hope boys and girls that you are ready to learn about the different kinds of community helpers in next week's discussion. That is all for now boys and girls. Until next week. Bye.